they have spotted the king's motorcade over there. There is traffic, the king's motorcade will make its way inside, so the king is arriving. But uh, these wars that you talk about within the family, after this it will be important for the family to sit down and resolve the issues and the tension, because if Kuno Kogozele and Lungkulu, Kuno Kogozele Sizwe. Ujalo, that is truth. I think today, because no ma ubanu mundo one kinis, we are born on Namshanja Guti. This is the king. So this will help us for all other people to realize and come back. Because even even if they are still away, we have a hope that one day we will see things um, in one eye and then we will come together and talk because the unity of the family means the unity of the nation so we have a dream that after all this people will see that no we can't do anything all the people of the zulu because as i'm saying there is a, a king from zambia there is a king from malawi these people originally they came from uh, our country they came from wazu now they are back home now this is the testimony that the Zulu nation must unite. If people from outside, from Zimbabwe, from Zambia and from Malawi come here, it's a pity if they come as we are undivided, we are, we are, not, we are divided. They must come and be united with us. So we hope that as we um, uh, introduce our king into the crown, things will get better, people will come back and we sit together and we chat the way forward as the Zulu nation. Okay, the king is arriving. I'm going to stay away from you. We're going to stay with the visuals of the arrival of the king. His motorcade is here. Joe Koman, a hardworking as he is, he is showing you those visuals. From now on, it's only a matter of seconds. The motorcade of Amazulu king, Misuzulu, Singobi, Lechome, Sakis, Kangugazuelitini, is entering the palace of Wakangela. Mankengane, and he will be arriving here, having left after performing rituals and ceremonies from midnight till the wee hours of the morning. Let's give you these. Uh, let's give you these live visuals of the king's motorcade with a heightened security here arriving at Wakandela Mankengane Royal Palace. Just look at this, look at the security that is around his car and look at what is happening here in terms of police visibility, heightened security, of course, with what is happening within the Zulu royal family. The threat to his life and of those who are contesting him is very high and you can see by the way his motorcade has been beefed up, his security has been beefed up. There are too many people at the palace. I see even Metropolis all the way from Deben is here accompanying the king. So this is the arrival of Amazon King, Misuzu Lukaswelitini, is arriving at the palace uh, to ensure that uh, they will be performing uh, whatever needs to be performed. We are told that the king will be going straight to the crown and and when he goes to the crown, that's when he will be ushered in. Let's try and uh, uh, literally run with this. Look at the heavy security here. People with high caliber rifles here. There is a special task force of the police that is guiding the king's motorcade here. He's going straight to the crown. And as we are bringing these live visuals to you, we will just run after or will just run in front of his convoy and motorcade the arrival of amazulu king misuzu lugazuelitini he will go straight to the kraal that's where he will be dressed up and this is the official start of the ceremony it simply means the ceremony is underway as the king has arrived wakangela mankengane royal palace let me give you natural sound Jokoman and my colleague will come with me as we listen to women.
Ibuto is already making its way inside the crawl here at Wakangela Mankengane the royal palace as we are staying with these visuals of King Misuzulu Kazweli team driving down going to the crawl of course he will have to disembark and walk inside the crawl here yeah, look at how heavily guarded his car is you've got uh, even members of the special task force of the police who are here ensuring that the king is protected there is an ongoing royal dispute and those who are contesting him also have raised concerns about their security saying their security needs to be beefed up because it's a very sensitive period and sensitive time within amazulu royal family this is the crowd many people have been waiting for this moment for a very long time to see the king entering the crown here this security clad in traditional gear here and they are ensuring that they are escorting the king all the way to inside the crown they are also senior members of the nazareth baptist church the king is a member of the nazareth baptist church by the way and they will enter this crown there will be a group of amabuto inside and then the king will be dropped off here. Right. Sorry, we will enter. We will use the other entrance on the other side here because the king will be dropped off. And then his security is trying basically to uh, clear the way here because there are too many people. Uh, the security detail trying to ask people to stop here and give way to the king's motorcade here so it's a very uh, busy day security wise it's a nightmare for the king's security because they are worried about his security here you can see how they've beefed up thousands of people have gathered at wakangela mankengane royal palace to witness this historic moment the king is going towards a very special traditional hut those who know the zulu culture will tell you that where he will be dropped off here this traditional hut is very special this is how the setup of the zulu okay. so let's see if we can go to the other side here just to get a shot of the king of Amazulu, King Misuzulu, Sinobile Shomesaki Shango, Kazuelitin here. He has arrived at the royal palace and he will be dropped off here. And uh, after being dropped off, of course, then the king will be ushered inside the kraal. And I'm trying to see Uguti, what will happen when the king is dropped off. Then I'm told that uh, he will have to go inside this and then let's just uh, take a listen and watch what is happening here before the king disembarks Okay. We've been uh, told just to make way and space here as Amazulu King, Misuzulu Gazwelitini, will disembark any minute from now. Senior Prince is here. I am here to ensure that everything is well coordinated. Uh, I'm not sure if you can still hear us. We seem to be struggling with the signal and the network this side, but I assume you are still with us. If that is the case, I will continue narrating what is happening here.
Praise singing is currently underway here as we await for King Mesuzulu Kazuluchi to disembark and he will enter this uh, very historic and symbolic uh, uh, traditional hut and then very soon we'll just see the king disembarking here he will be walking entering of course we'll have to cut we will not be inside uh, we, because we need to respect what is happening there. Uh, it's very sacred and you need to give space to the king who has disembarked here. Let's just stay with these visuals and give natural sound. Come on, let's Amazulu King Misuzulu Gazwelitin is going inside to enter a very special and historic traditional hut. After that, he will emerge from that hut and go straight inside the Kekl Kral. And when he is inside there, he will be joining Amabuto, members of the royal family, and other people who are there. So it's very difficult now for uh, members of the royal family, security as well, who are trying to control the onlookers here, the subjects of the king. I'm going to ask my colleague Joko Mane to give you an elevated shot and visuals of this. Look at people who are around just here where the king is. They include senior princes, members of the royal family, and Amabuto, and uh, they are trying to ensure that there is order and there is stability here. And uh, what is currently happening is that uh, uh, it's difficult to control what is happening. You would understand the interest here. This is the king of Amazulu as a nation. Many people have an interest on what is happening. Doing this ritual during the day was always going to be problematic because the king has had to enter this specially designed traditional hut, which is very symbolic here. And you know the way it's been designed, there is a crown on the other side and then on top or on the other side of the crawl you have this traditional hut where the king is inside now and uh, what will be happening is uh, so it's a very significant day for Amazulu as a nation it's going to be challenging bringing it to you know bringing some of it to your life because uh, of what is happening with security but you will understand that even without security there are certain sacred royals or rituals rather that cannot be seen by members of the public so we will respect that we'll give you whatever we can give you please bear in mind that also there is a signal jamming here because there are too many people who are here so what we will be doing is let's just take a walk to the kraal and then we will wait for the king inside the kraal for now we'll have to cut from where we are let's take a walk with my colleague Joe Komane. Let's go inside the crawl to wait for the king inside the crawl. Leave what is being done there because it's a very private and sacred moment for uh, the royal family. Very few senior members of the royal family are there with the king inside that traditional hut. But look at what is happening outside the crawl itself a historic moment amazulu here to witness their king entering the crawl he was inside this crawl yesterday we'll just walk around we'll just walk around and go inside the traditional kirky crawl and that's where amabuto or mama and other members of the family are waiting for the king we will see if that will be possible for us to go in and bring it to you as there is more song and dance currently happening right now as we wait for uh,
This is the inside of the crown. Look at what is happening here in terms of the number of people that are already inside here waiting for the king to enter this crawl. He was here last night and you can see Amabuto here singing. So you will see here on my left, Joko Mane is showing you the visuals of Amabuto. Everyone who's here is clad in traditional attire, displaying culture and tradition and the beauty of Sizwe Samazuru. This is where the king will come and of course you will not be able to see all what will be happening here. So this section of the crawl is pent, everyone. But on my right, I'm going to ask Joe Komane to show you. There is a skin that has been cordoned off. Well, those are visuals coming in from Guanongo. My king, Mrs. Zulu, as well, he has already uh, made his way into the crowd. We may uh, rather, of course, expect to see him inside uh, for a bit of a while. I mean, uh, that heavy security there uh, escorting his car uh, did not, of course, uh, compromise just in terms of security because, as we heard from Prince Tulani, too many people, more than they anticipated, came out in their numbers out in Guanongo, of course, to hear from uh, what is happening in Guacan. Angela Mangenga and